It started. I can't stop it now, a whole new regeneration cycle. Just breaking it in. It all just disappears, doesn't it? Everything you are gone in a moment, like breath on a mirror. Any moment now, he's a coming. The doctor. We all change. And when you think about it, we are all different people all through our lives. And that's okay, that's good, as long as you remember all the people that you used to be. I will not forget one line of this. Not one day, I swear. I will always remember We couldn't tell much from the autopsy, uh... Because the coyotes had been in her pretty good. And let me tell you, I've been killing those sons of bitches ever since. It's why you do what you do, it's who you are, but the people need the church more than ever. You can feel it. And I know the Cardinal may not be perfect, but we're not going to throw out all the good he's doing over a few bad apples. Look, I'm bringing this up because it's Baron's idea, his agenda, and I got to tell you, honest to God, I don't think he cares about this city the way we do. I mean, how could he? So this is how it happens, huh? What's that? One guy leans on another guy and suddenly the whole town's looking the other way. <sighs> Robbie, look. Marty Barron's just trying to make his mark. He's gonna be here for a couple of years and then he's gonna move on, just like he did in New York and Miami. Where are you gonna go? Pete. When we do run the story, I'm gonna need a statement from the Cardinal. We'll talk again later. Good night, Robbie. When did you learn to speak? I don't think I did learn. And that's strange, isn't it? Because language is something that people acquire. Well, some believe that language exists in the brain at birth, and what is learned is the ability to connect words and structures to the latent ability. Do you think? Why else would she have you meet her at a bar at 10 in the morning? I just figured she was a raging alcoholic! <laughs> oh! And all this time I've been going through such pain and personal anguish. <laughs> such hell! All for nothing! Oh my god. Oh, oh that's, that's good. That's, oh. that's good stuff. Okay, okay, we get it. You set the scene. Mm -hmm. Now, just read your mother's line. Alright, okay. Shelly, Shelly, how many times have I told you not to leave your sciencey stuff out on the porch? Oh, goodness, I'll never understand that boy. But then again, I am a religious nut, so my mind is close to very, very many things. Ooh, 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 ooh. Spock to Enterprise. Transport successful. Glory be to heaven. So, some sort of creature is manifested out of thin air. George, put down that Pepsi can full of bourbon. You're not fooling anybody, and get your shotgun. Greetings, Mary Cooper. I am Spock. Well, I should probably go for physics. Monotov wants me to write an essay on the greatest invention to ever benefit mankind. Oh, that's easy. That's uh, antiseptics. The whole sanitation thing. Joseph Lister, 1895. Before antiseptics were even invented, like nothing was sanitized, especially in medicine. <laughs>